you mean the expensive bassinet that mothers love to shame me for having? Because apparently I don't rock my baby to sleep or ever hold my baby with that thing. Yeah, let's talk about it. So this new is crazy expensive, so I rent mine. But I've spent more money in rent because I had my last two babies back to back than I would if I would have just bought it. So I'm the dumbass. But I did like that it had a renting option because it is really expensive. But however, they have great resale value. So I got this with my fourth kid. I've used it for my fourth, fifth, day and night. Day and night difference. Oh my gosh, my fourth and fifth kids are sleeping in such longer stretches than my other three ever have. And because of the rocking motion, I'm so easily able to rock my baby to sleep. Yes! I still rock my baby to sleep. I'm gonna be able to transfer them into his bassinet so much easier. The built-in swaddle for those first few weeks gave me absolute peace of mind. And you can do the swaddle arms out too. Like it doesn't have to be all enclosed. So when they get older, you can still use it. So a lot of times I did a video on this about active sleep. Babies aren't necessarily crying. They're still sleeping, but they're making lots of noises and their sleep cycle gets disrupted. So the snoo will rock them back into a more peaceful sleep. So you don't have to do it. It's just so you can sleep a little bit more. You're still holding your baby.